Hey guys and welcome to Selection Box Science. This one is all about welding with chocolate, which is one of my favourite ingredients. Um, what you need to do, find yourself a selection box or whatever your chocolate you've got lying around over Christmas. You also need a jug full of hot water. Now, I just poured in water from the kettle, but make sure you get an adult to help you with that because trust me, it does kind of smart if it gets in your hands. Um, my favourite chocolate for this, Milky Bars. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to melt the Milky Bars, the edges of the Milky Bars, and connect them together, weld them together. So, all you need to do is heat them on the side of the bottle, like this, and you can see them melting on the edge. Heat them up, and then connect them together. Like that. And you want these connected at 90 degrees. Now, what you need to do is you're going to need to repeat this a number of times. Obviously, you need one more section like this and then connect them together really delicately. The great thing is, if it goes wrong, you just eat the ingredients. Pop that down in, uh, in the fridge to cool and then I'll show you what I've made earlier. All right, these have been in the fridge for a few hours. You'll see I've just put two 90 degree sections together and made what's known as a box girder bridge. Now, take two glasses or whatever you've got and just put one of your chocolate bars down this is a plank bridge. Put how, however much weight, whatever load you can put on top of it as possible, whether that's other containers or other chocolates, and eventually it will start to deform, we call it deflect, and then it will break under the load. And then try the same with your box girder bridge and see how much load that can take. And also try it with other chocolate bars and other shapes. Got uh, some curly whirlies here, another of my favorites. So just have an experiment with whatever chocolate you've got lying around and um, tweet us some pictures.